Well, this is our first turtle that we've actually treated. Um, I think her prognosis isn't great. She's really sick. Um, she, when she came in yesterday, she you know, barely lifted her head up. Um, I think she's a little bit stronger today. Um, and we've managed to get an IV line and get her fluids and everything else. So we're doing everything we can do. Um, the thing with turtles is they take a long time to get sick, but they also take a long time to get better. So we're probably not going to see many much improvement for a little while. So I'm not sure what her prognosis is at this stage. This um, turtle arrived at Otaki Beach yesterday. Um, she's a um, an adult female turtle and she, green sea turtle, um, and she was found by a member of the public really debilitated and sick. Um, so she's outside of her range by a long, a long way. So she normally um, is a tropical animal and being in the waters of Otaki, I think it's probably 10 degrees colder than she should be in. Um, so she came in in what we call cold shock, where um, her body temperature Turtles get their body temperature from the external environment and because she's in cold water, she's got cold, things are shut down. Um, so when she came in yesterday, she was uh, um, really weak, um, emaciated, lots of what we call edema, which is where fluid pulls around. Um, she's got a really low protein and low blood cells. Um, so, but we don't think that's a primary cause. She's got a couple of injuries to her shell, so we wonder if she's had some traumatic injury and she's been really weak, ended up on a ocean current. Um, and she's ended up in Otaki, so, um, so we're treating her for a cold shock, but actually the primary cause of her disease we're trying to find out. Um, so the CT scan, we're quite lucky because um, we're able to, to basically scan the whole turtle and look for any abnormalities. So the things we're looking for are um, potentially um, a pneumonia, which they sometimes have, um, any signs of internal trauma, she's got those marks, so she might have been um, munched by a, a predator shark or something like that. Um, we're also looking for things that, um, that problems that are caused by humans. So a lot of these guys will ingest bits of plastic and they'll get the stomach full with plastic, um, fish hooks and things like that. So we're just going to basically it's a bit of a search to see if we can find out what, why she's sick.